Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. On today's video, I'll show you how to make these detachable cuffs. I have made this wrist cuff from cotton fabric and it looks like that and it is adjustable there with velcro as you can see i have made this wrist cuff from velcro and elastic and it looks like that so it can be adjusted with velcro like that so it fits all wrist sizes so this is the right side it looks like that and this is the wrong side now I will show you how I make my wrist cuff. This fabric is 65 centimeters long and 15 centimeters wide. And first I will be hemming edges on this cotton fabric. I'm folding this edge approximately five millimeters to the wrong side and folding it again. So it looks like that. And I'm starting hemming my corner. So it's nice and sharp. And I'm continuing hemming my pattern. As you can see, I have hemmed all other edges. This is how I hem edge on this fabric. So it looks like that, nice and sharp corner on both corners and on other side. Next, I will iron this button flat. So here's my prepared cuff pattern. Next, I'll be using this elastic, which is 18 centimeters long and 1.5 centimeters wide. I'm folding this elastic in half and pinning center. And I'm folding this button in half also and pinning center. Next, I'll sew elastic on this pattern piece. So this is the right side and this is the wrong side where that seam edge is. I'm placing this elastic there. So it looks like that. And I'll be using this seam guide and I'm placing this seam guide to 3.5 centimeter width there. And I'm pinning my elastic to the center on top there and I'm placing this elastic end like that on this cotton button like that and I will sew there and the distance between seam guide and elastic is 3.5 centimeters and I will sew on top there one millimeter on edge of this elastic I'm pulling my elastic slightly so it is stretchy and I'm gathering cotton fabric under the elastic like that so the gathering is even on a cuff and I'm making sure that cotton pattern edge is touching the seam guide so the distance between elastic and seam guide is 3.5 centimeters and when I have reached the center I'm removing the pin and I'm continuing to sew and removing other pin on a cotton pattern there and I'm continuing sewing other side same way as you can see I'm pulling that elastic and gathering that cotton underneath so the gathering is nice and even and this is how it looks after I sewed one side on this elastic gathering looks nice and even this is the right side and this is the wrong side Next, I'll sew other side on this elastic. I'm removing the seam guard, I won't need it anymore. And I'm sewing other side on this elastic. I'm pulling elastic when I sew, so it's nice and stretchy. And I'm evening out the cotton fabric underneath and sewing this edge too. And here's my prepared cuff button. Elastic is sewed on and it looks like that. Next, I'll sew on Velcro on this cuff. Same way like on this cuff. As you can see here this soft velcro is 4.5 centimeters by 2 centimeters i'm placing this soft velcro on the wrong side there and i'm pinning that velcro on the edge there and i will sew all around there next i'm taking this sharp velcro side which is 3.5 centimeters by 2 centimeters and i'm placing this velcro piece on the right side on other edge there and i'm pinning this velcro piece there and i will sew all around there now i will sew on these velcro pieces as i pinned
This is how it looks after I sewed on softer side of the velcro on the wrong side as you can see here. Next I will sew this sharper side of the velcro on the right side there. So both velcro pieces are sewed on and it looks like that. And my adjustable and detachable cuff is finished and it looks like that. Now I will try on my new cuffs. So as you can see, your velcro edges can be adjustable there on both cuffs. Looks like that. Also, these cuffs can be worn under the jumper sleeve, not just on top of the sleeve, but also you can put your jumper sleeves over like that. Looks really cute and it's quite nice a way to dress up your outfit. If you have any questions how I made these adjustable, detachable cuffs, please comment down below in a comment box. I will add all materials which I use to make these cuffs on a description box. Thank you so much for watching this video. I will see you next time. Love Anita.